people potluck, what are the plans for food and cooking? Tom? Christmas starts for us about the 20th, whether I want it to or not. I actually help with the cookies. You know the little round uh, peanut butter cookies? You see the little lines on them? That's what I do with the fork. What? That's all I'm capable of. Now, we have to have four types of cookies that are set out at the table. And we have four sets of people that come all day. That's wonderful. That's wonderful. It starts around 9 o'clock. It's the four kids and their family. And they eat lasagna. Then the relatives come over, her side. They have to have ham. Then the distant cousins come over, they have to have turkey. And now we got the new kids with the freaking vegan stuff. So the nice thing about it is they get to eat all the time. But in groups, they go home. And that's really cool. Because what's better than having the food and they go home? Now, as far as what were the other two subjects? You did all of them. When you're Christmas time. Every year, all my family goes, write down five things you want. And we'll get you one of them. Guess what? I don't get any of them. What the hell's the use of the thing? They don't pay attention. I don't get it. As far as the Christmas trees and the, uh, on the outside of the house, we have a condo. Now, this hmm, guy just showed up, moved in next door. He's got everything all over the place. Half on my stairs, down in the grass. Don't walk over there. It might knock over the reindeer. And he's got a nice little dog that comes in. Okay? So, uh, we're going to have a good Christmas, I think. Because I'm, I'm looking at, uh, John, I'm looking at a 380. So that's my story, and I'm sticking to it. Thanks, Tom. In our house, when it comes to cooking, my wife is a one-man army. <laughs>